Good afternoon, YouTube. This video is on an 89 Dodge Cummins first gen. Cummins first gen. I've never seen a video on how to change this. It's the switch for your ignition, which is not actually in the ignition, it's on the column. If you're having problems where you lose power to your gauges, your AC head unit, and your radio, most likely it's that problem right there. There's a shaft that goes to it, under it. Here's the old, the new one hooked up. Goes right up in there. And it's a simple switch that goes back and forth with the key. Turns the power off and on. And I was having problems with that. So there it's all plugged up just to test it, make sure it was working and it works. Pull two screws down from the column and start working and get it done. Your radio should turn on, your key should turn in and out and go from there. My ignition switch is actually bypassed on that little uh, black switch. The previous owner did that. To be honest with you, I like it. I don't mind it. So I don't touch it. It stays that way. And there you go. Hope you guys enjoy.